Area relief agencies continue to prepare for Ukrainian refugees as part of President Joe Biden's 100,000-person relocation plan. In the meantime, those already in Erie are settling into a new way of life. JET 24 Scott Bremner spoke with some of them and has more tonight. You can't blame 25-year-old Nila Persenyuk for being a little worried about how she'd be welcome in America after taking a path from the Ukraine through Poland to Amsterdam to Mexico to Pittsburgh to Erie. At first, yes, of course, I was scared, but then I came here and I met all these amazing people at the church and I was overwhelmed, to be honest, and I was so, so thankful and happy to meet these amazing people who really want to love on me and help me. One thing making the experience easier is Ukrainian families here willing to help arriving refugees get comfortable. While Ukrainian families are willing to help, so are area charities. But two questions still remain. We still don't know how many refugees are coming and when they're going to get here. But the charities are doing all they can, like looking for families with Ukrainian ties willing to house the refugees when they do arrive here. I would encourage other families in the Erie area that uh, if they're thinking about the same sort of thing, they can contact us here at Catholic Charities and perhaps that will help us on our housing problems. And with those adjusting to a new life in a new land with relatives not seen in years. When she came, she um, was a little uh, unsure of what to think because she hasn't seen them in such a long time. Uh, but when she got here, the, everybody made everything so comfortable for her and it made her feel uh, safe and at home in a, in a way. Scott Bremner, Jet 24, Action News.